Hi, I'm Casey Calvert, and I am Holly Randall's Bombshell of the Month. Uh, my favorite thing about modeling is that it gives me the time and the freedom to do whatever I want to do, whether that's work or travel or take a day off and stay home. It lets me do, it lets me control my own schedule in a way that I really love. And my least favorite thing about modeling, it's tricky. It might be, it's certainly not all of the fan interactions that I have, the majority of the fan interactions I have are really, really positive and really, really incredible. But those like 1% of fans that are assholes gets to me. My favorite thing about directing is that I get to tell stories. I get to create worlds and fill them with people, and that is really incredible to me. And my least favorite thing about directing is that you're the person in charge, and everything is your responsibility. And that is great, but also that is very stressful. I guess my greatest fear, the first thing that comes to mind anyway, is failure. I am a perfectionist uh, to a fault, and I am not great at not being successful, and the idea of actually failing at something gives me a lot of anxiety. Yeah, I do believe in true love. I also believe in soulmates. I also believe that you can have more than one true love and more than one soulmate. My favorite hobby is napping. My favorite thing to do when I'm not working is take a really nice two hour nap in the afternoon. Otherwise, I like watching movies and TV. I knit sometimes. I have a lot of houseplants. Um, pretty, pretty casual, boring things. I go rock climbing. That's a thing that I do. Yeah. The first thing that comes to mind, and I'm just kind of going with the first thing that comes to mind for all of these questions today, is there is a book called Florida by an author named Lauren Groff. Uh, she's from my hometown, not that I've ever met her or anything, um, but she wrote this book that, uh, I grew up in Florida, and this book transports you very much to the place in North Central Florida where I grew up and all of these experiences that I had, and the prose is so beautiful that it made me cry, not because it was sad, just because it's so beautiful and so poetic, and I find her writing incredibly inspiring for my own storytelling. So this question is really tricky because there are a lot of different times I want to go to and could choose, but also there are a lot of different times where being a woman was really shitty. And so I have to decide if I want to choose a time that was really cool, but also like being there in this body might really suck. I think like, like the jazz age. I'd like to go to the jazz age and just like live in, in that kind of opulence. So the top three places I want to go to, I'll go backwards, I guess. Number three is New Zealand. Number two is Iceland. 
And number one is a place I very, very badly want to go to, but only under very specific circumstances. I very much want to go to Antarctica, but I don't want to go on a stupid cruise boat and be like, hee hee hee, I'm in Antarctica. I want to actually apply for a job and go and work there either like doing research or even like I would be the trash truck driver for the opportunity to go to Antarctica and be there for a couple of months. I think that would, that's just like, that's number one. Do I believe in life on other planets? Yeah. Do I believe in the alien conspiracy? Maybe, I don't actually know. Yeah, I, I do, I have. Um, there is somebody in my life who I met because they, we, we met on Twitter and they were a fan and I was a fan of them. And now we are dating, so yes. A, a, a very select fan, like not necessarily like any fan, but yeah. So I know a stupid amount about early 20th century architecture. I think it's real cool. I, like speaking of, I don't know how much you can actually see on that camera, but like, I just, uh, I love the way that we used to build houses and the way old houses feel and the craftsmanship that a 2021 house just doesn't have. Today, for this answer of my celebrity crush, uh, I have a massive crush on Phoebe Bridgers. Um, if you don't know who she is, she's an incredibly talented musician and has an incredible voice and is also very, very pretty. And just, I love her music and I think that she is incredible. I'm Casey Calvert. I hope you enjoyed getting to know me a little bit more today. You can check out all of the beautiful content that we shot today on Holly Randall's website. I will see you soon. Bye.